This is Gigok, and you're watching Mad Lad of Culture. Hello, everyone. Welcome to Magic Giji Haro. Woo! So this is my first impression to this new upcoming rom-com anime for the Thursday, alongside with Gimai Sekatsu. And definitely Thursday is becoming more like a harum romance every Thursday now because we got the Goddess Cafe layer on too. So holy cow, I am actually really excited to check out the first episode. Not because you can say this manga is apparently very popular in Japan, and apparently. The the manga is also very highly rated on my email list too. So you know manga readers are so excited for this, even though the manga finished like quite a long time ago already. But still, man, finally we're getting anime adaptation. And of course, most importantly, the reason why I'm excited, not because I'm a rom-com guy, but also the voice actor is top tier for the main duo, man. Like, wow, Saori is here to voice the girl. And that is enough to get me excited already, man. Because so from what I can see from the trailer, not only the fact that Rin is so adorably cute that she has some crazy girl out girlishly face that she can maybe making but also the fact that you know Saori is voicing her giving her some uh, very interesting character from what I can see from the trailer is enough to sell it to me man and of course Yuta's been voiced by Bakugo and that makes it even more interesting but still it is definitely gonna be a very fun anime to watch on the Thursday although I'm not too sure if it's something I want to like react to this for the rest of the season but this like I said this is the first impression reaction it's up to you guys to see what no, you guys want me to do with the reaction by commenting below and liking the video and that is what really matters but for me though i'm watching this because i don't want to see some interesting coupling moment between them because from what i can see these two are gonna have a very interesting dynamic moments they'll be they'll be sharing with each other like bantering and doing all these coupling things maybe or maybe just a lot of bantering but oh my god i can tell you guys this, the trailer was enough to get me excited just give a first impression already man i cannot wait to see some ring greatness too so with that said let's get started reaction shall we Okay, we here and let's get started with the brand new anime on the Thursday. And this one seems very promising, by the way. Giga said we must watch too. So holy cow, after checking out the trailer and of course the sneak peek to the opening that dropped like last month, I gotta say, I think I'm actually really excited for this one too. So with that, here we play. Wait, Billy Billy? What the fuck? Why is it on Billy Billy? Yo. I wasn't expecting Billy Billy to be the one to start of the episode, but okay. I thought it would be like, you know, Kodokawa and stuff like that. This is not based in China, right? No, it's Japan. I saw Japanese words. Up oh, there's a girl. Can't wait to hear some sorry greatness, man. Sorry is going to dominate her character today. Yo, such a strong high mean voice. I love it. Up, oh, there's a boy. Boys by none other than Bakugo, everyone. <laughs> mm hmm. Low. What was the hell was that? <laughs> Nana Karareen. <laughs> Oh my god. Wow, that was awkward. Wow. <laughs> wow. Their love life already began from here. Interesting. That's how they met or something. This is how I met your mom. So, in other words, the club's quite established then. He, dude, he was obviously faking it, man. <laughs> oh, she's in love already. Unbelievable. She's already in love. I mean, she is a voice actor, aka Saori. Mm hmm. <laughs> oh my god, that's acting? That acting? Okay, she's in the zone, right? She's in the zone. Oh, here we go. Oi! Oh my god. 
He recited the line so perfectly too. Oh my god, sorry, Hayami, man. You didn't go so hard with that scene though. That voice acting. Well, oh, that's what she's here for. <laughs> okay. Well, that was an easy recruitment. <laughs> what is he going to do now? A teaser or something? Or is he just going to be more fascinated by her and everything she does? Well, I'm looking forward to see what sort of interesting love story we're going to have for this anime. I mean, obviously, off to a very interesting style where she's been recruited to a drama club, but I think this is where her acting is going to be tested. Being a very cute girl like this. See? <laughs> oh my gosh, she's going to make a lot of faces, is she? She's going to make a lot of faces. Hey, see the title? Yeah, he actually said the title of this anime. Sundere. Sundere. Okay. I'm buying it. I'm loving it. Wow. I'm pretty sure this is what this anime is about. She being different sort of personality girls to impress her senpai. Dude, this is going to be so fun to watch, man. Definitely. In terms of you no know, Saori's voice acting wise. I think Saori is literally going to be the, one of the best voice actors for the season because of her character right now because she's going for different tone voices when she allowed her to act like that. Like that. That was that was cool. That was cool. That was so cool, man. Hey. Oh my god. Her acting is phenomenal, man. She deserves an Oscar, by the way. <laughs> oh, what are you gonna do? Feed him? You're gonna feed him. <laughs> what the hell was that for right there? Twitter? Why did you go on Twitter? <laughs> Why did Twitter? Oh, uh, now the cool version. Nice. Cool girl. Oh no. What? Made cafe form now? Hey, she wasted food. She wasted food. Again, go for it. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> nope, never mind. Uh -huh. Wow, how smart of you to do that. <laughs> oh my god, what that says that? That smug face, that smug. Dude, this is the one of the best way to get a boy's number, man. Pretending to look for his phone, but he gets a bit. Again. Yeah. 
Maybe she's just maybe she's just gonna be a Sundar for the rest of the season if this actually works. And now he has her number. Hey. Oh my god, you just wasted some foam bill right there, man. But okay, at least they are getting along quite nicely. <laughs> Oh my god, he's he's taking advantage of her acting, isn't she? My god, this is getting weird now because you know you keep on asking her to be different girls. I guess I can understand why this is called pseudo harem in the first place now, because he's literally dating multiple girls in one body. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, 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 God, that was, that was too brutal for my heart. That was too brutal for my heart. Oh my God. She, sorry, you have to go too hard with that voice acting, man. Holy shit. Oh my God, that killed my heart right there. Now what? And she's fainted. <laughs> Wait, what happened? Well, what's going on? Oh my god, seriously? Really now? Uh-huh. Hehehehe. <laughs> Low. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Oh my god. Stop it, Rin. Stop it, Rin. You're kidding me right now. Dude, her face is killing me softly, man. This is just so peak. Ha 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 ha, what are you gonna do to wake him up? Kiss? Kiss him in the cheek? <laughs> oh my god. Oh! Oh my god. Oh! Stop it. Stop it, Rin. Stop it. Stop it, man. You're killing me softly. Oh, peak. <laughs> Hmm. 
Uh. Hmm. Aren't they a bit too close though? Aren't they too close from that range? <laughs> oh! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> what the hell those eyes, man? <laughs> that face though. <laughs> oh my god, I mean, the, every picture of Rin is uh, like a uh, treasure, I would say. She gets food mark or something. Food marks. I'm calling it right now. Oh, average. Okay, so she's just average then. Okay, I thought for a second she's gonna be like food mark soap girl. Oh, smug. Oh shit, that's smug. Hey. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm glad she's working hard for him. Now what? Why are they fighting over Giblin or something? What's going on here? Oh, cooking contest. Uh, wow, this your life depends on it, girl. Your life depends on this. Hmm. Right. What? What is it? <laughs> Hey, I'm happy for you, man. I'm happy for you, Rin. You chose your boyfriend's cooking. <laughs> oh my god. Whoa, oh, I'd love to see her in that dress though. I would love to see her in that. Wow, really? Cinder mode?
Mmm. Wow. A loungewear. Hey! Oh! Oh! Peak! I would love to see it though. Peak! Why she change her hair to like that? Why she wait for the Yankee look? <laughs> what the fuck? That's one. That is some insane bad hair, though. Oh, that's fuck. Oh my god, that Goku hair, man. That's what you call bad hair. Well, I'm glad they're getting along because of some wacky moments like this. Why is he cold now? Is he sick or something? Cinder, eh? <laughs> oh my god. Yeah. Oh, how sweet of him, man. How sweet of him. <laughs> wow, that was so sweet of him, man. <laughs> oh, shit. It's cold tomorrow. Yeah. Oh my god, that was shit yeah, though, so cute. Hey, let's check out the ending theme. It's being sang by Sauri, by the way. Oh, not bad. I love the instrumental already. Yep, that's Sauri, alright. Yo, why did he go for a very poppy like instrumental? And that's the manga. Holy shit. How they're blending the manga and the anime. I love it. Whoa, yo, girl, holy shit. Wow, okay. <laughs> oh my god, really with her different faces, man. I love it. Yo, she's literally like Ben 10 with faces. Oh, that's that's cute face. I love that face. Love that. Hey, hey. I love the show. I love this anime. And not because of this of like gaggy wacky relationship going on between AG and Rin is because Rin herself is stealing the spotlight. Or to be more exact though, I would say that Sari Hayamin is the one stealing the spotlight because you know she's going with all these weird gaggy voice acting moments where the Rin had to you know change her persona, her personality to fit the character that AG wanted to be. 
So she's literally Ben 10 of all faces, man. So now I can't understand why this anime is called Pseudo Harum. It's because, well, AG doesn't really have a lot of girls around him, but the, the but she literally have all sort of girl inside one body, and that one body is Rin, and where she when and she can switch up emotions, personality, just to fit the liking of AG. So I can definitely see the appeal of this anime because we're gonna see the best of Rin trying to impress AG with her well acting. I was saying this case, and she is slowly killing me every time she went for the cute faces. And not gonna lie to you guys, I'm starting to debate whether or not i should put on my top three best girl for this season because the, the top three is already been secured with akane um saki ayase and um what's there's another one oh yeah oh yeah but oh my god rin i am really really finding it hard to see whether or not i want to put it in my top three but definitely this anime is a very fun watch definitely a very fun watch and definitely i can enjoy reacting to this anime every thursday but the biggest thing i want to know is whether you guys want me to react to this for the rest of the season or just watch this in my own time or make it too short for it it's all down to you guys in the end of course but for me personally though i really really enjoyed the first episode especially now i can understand the theme of this anime and why this anime uh, why the manga was very popular because the, the whole theme of it is seen rin has been tested with her acting skills by AG and asking her to go and perform all sorts of personalities, which Saori Hayamin, the experienced voice actor, can do, of course. So, oh my god, this show is definitely one of my favorite for the season already, man. Definitely looking forward to see what sort of interesting faces she's gonna do for the remaining of the season. Although I'm still kind of curious though whether AG will start to like her as a you know as a person or really just love to tease her around, like you know teasing Master Kakaraki. So. Well, looking forward to more from this anime. But like I said, if you guys want me to continue reacting to this anime, smash that like button, comment below. And with that said, I'll see you guys next week. Hopefully see you guys next week for episode 2 reaction. Bye-bye.